Sequoia State Park offers a break from the hectic pace of everyday life. We have everything that you would want for a, a day trip or if you have a conference, if you've got just you want to come for a weekend, you've got a meeting that you want to hold or if you want to camp, you want to rent a boat, you want to go horseback riding, you want anything that you could possibly want in the outdoors, we probably have it here. But the centerpiece of this splendid park is the beautiful lodge. After an extensive renovation, the lodge reopened in 2015. And by the way, this is the largest of Oklahoma's state park lodges, and it's outstanding. With the lodge, you have 104 rooms in the lodge, uh, 44 cabins, a bunkhouse that will sleep 44, cabanas, suites, so we can pretty well suit anybody's needs for any type of, if they want to stay in a, a resort type setting. So, and you'll be right here at the end of a peninsula. Water surrounds it all. It's a beautiful view on all sides. Uh, wildlife abounds here and pretty much, like I said, any type of recreation or outdoor activity you'd like to do, we have it here. Located on the shores of Fort Gibson Lake, water lovers are drawn to this park. There are over 19,000 surface acres of water and 225 miles of shoreline, and they have the largest marina on the lake. For your relaxation and enjoyment, there's also water trikes, kayaks, and boat rentals. The Three Forks Nature Center has live animals and all kinds of educational displays. A two-mile paved trail in the park is perfect for walking, hiking, running, or biking. Or you can enjoy a round of golf on their 18-hole course. That's another big draw for people. And of course, then we have the camping. You got the RV and the tent camping that's here in the park. Those have also been renovated in the last two years. Two of the RV areas are completely new. One just opened in May, and it's been a big hit with all the campers, big spaces. Because this is a big place with a big lodge and a big pool. Given Oklahoma's unpredictable weather, the pool will usually open Memorial Day and close around Labor Day. But when it is open, it's not uncommon to see this different kind of a wave in the pool. Now don't forget, at the lodge, you also have a very good restaurant. We open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, normally on weekends, we'll stay open till nine o'clock, weekdays till eight o'clock. So if you're looking for breakfast or lunch or dinner, we're, we're open. This area is a haven for families. While here, the living is easy and people see the change, the transformation that's taken place over the last couple of years. People are amazed at, at the difference that it made. I mean, they still see the old frame of the building but they, when they walk in, they see that it's all been, it's new, and they, they just couldn't believe that we actually made that big a difference in the remodel. So if it's been a while since you've been here, it's time to come back and see the incredible change. And if you've never been here, it's time to treat yourself to something very special. The people that we see that come in every year, number one has always been, wow, I didn't know it was here. And the second is, what a wonderful facility. You know, we're going to come back, we're going to bring, come back when we're planning to stay longer because we didn't get to do everything that was here. So they want, you know, they didn't know that we had a recreation department. They didn't know we had cabins. They didn't know that we had all these things to do inside the park. 